Hello traders. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. If I had to guess one of your biggest struggles in trading it would be not knowing when to take your profits or let the trade run to its full potential. You often exit a profitable trade with a small amount missing a huge opportunity. And other times you leave the trade open just to see the price come back to your entry level. What if I told you I have a solution for this? It involves using the Bollinger Bands indicator and it will help you find the trend in a second and you'll know exactly where to set your targets and stop orders. You know the drill like subscribe and stick around for the full video. I think more people need to know about because day trading and swing trading amazing result. In this video we will take you through the complete details about the simple Bollinger Band stops indicator. First of all let us know about trading indicator. The green and red lines visible in the chart are called Bollinger Band stops which tells us about the market trend. The low oscillator which is visible in the chart is called Shan Momentum Oscillator Indicator. This is our trading indicator. Let's see how to use trading indicators. Let's start. When the Bollinger Band stops gives us sell signals when Shan Momentum Oscillator of Histogram should be downtrend. When the market forms a bearish candle, if this condition is fulfilled then we will place a sell order. Our stop loss will be placed at the moving average axis of ST line. And the risk to reward ratio will be 1 is to 1.5. The market has completely hit the target. I hope you must have understood this trading strategy. When the Bollinger Band stops indicator gives us by signals. When Shan Momentum Oscillator of Histogram should be uptrend. When the market forms a bullish candle if this condition is fulfilled then we will place a buy order. Our stop loss will be placed at the moving average axis of ST line. And the risk to reward ratio will be 1 is to 1.5. The market has completely hit the target. I hope you must have understood this trading strategy. If not, then it doesn't matter, we are going to see examples of some trades. The Bollinger Band stops indicator gives us sell signals. The Shan Momentum Oscillator of Histogram should be downtrend. The market forms a bearish candle. If this condition is fulfilled then we will place a sell order. Our stop loss will be placed at the moving average axis of ST line. And the risk to reward ratio will be 1 is to 1.5. The market has completely hit the target. Let's see the next trade. The Bollinger Band stops indicator gives us by signals. The Shan Momentum Oscillator of Histogram should be uptrend. The market forms a bullish candle. If this condition is fulfilled then we will place a buy order. Our stop loss will be placed at the moving average axis of ST line. And the risk to reward ratio will be 1 is to 1.5. The market has completely hit the target. Let's see the next trade. The Bollinger Band stops indicator gives us sell signals. The Shan Momentum Oscillator of Histogram should be downtrend. The market forms a bearish candle. If this condition is fulfilled then we will place a sell order. Our stop loss will be placed at the moving average axis of ST line. And the risk to reward ratio will be 1 is to 1.5. The market has completely hit the target. Let's see the next trade.
the Bollinger band stops indicator gives us by signals. The Shan momentum oscillator of histogram should be uptrend. The market forms a bullish candle. If this condition is fulfilled then we will place a buy order. Our stop loss will be placed at the moving average X of ST line. And the risk to reward ratio will be 1 is to 1.5. The market has completely hit the target. Let's see the next trade. The Bollinger Band stops indicator gives us sell signals. The Shan momentum oscillator of histogram should be downtrend. The market forms a bearish candle. If this condition is fulfilled then we will place a sell order. Our stop loss will be placed at the moving average X of ST line and the risk to reward ratio will be 1 is to 1.5. The market has completely hit the target. Let's see the next trade. The Bollinger Band stops indicator gives us by signals. The Shan momentum oscillator of histogram should be uptrend. The market forms a bullish candle. If this condition is fulfilled then we will place a buy order. Our stop loss will be placed at the moving average X of ST line. And the risk to reward ratio will be 1 is to 1.5. The market has completely hit the target. Let's see the next trade. Now we will see the indicator setup. First of all we will search Bollinger Band Stops in Trading View. Now we will click on Bollinger Band Stops. Change Settings. Now we will change the length 20 to 34 in the settings. Now we will search Moving Average X in Trading View. Now we will click on Moving Average X. Now we will search Final Indicator Shan Momentum Oscillator. Now we will change some settings. I hope you must have liked this trading strategy. If you get to learn something new on our channel, then do subscribe to our YouTube channel. Thank you for watching our video. See you in the next video.